The original idea was just to come and do a gig for Hunter. You can lend one, so why don't we do an auction as well? And so we rang everyone around the country, get people to put in, do an eBay auction. We organised it all within a week. You know, everyone was right behind it. The support is huge. The Australian hip hop community got together. It's the 8th of August, 2010, and um, I've got neuroendocrine cancer, um, fuck, what does that mean? I don't even know. Uh, I don't know, any other guy on the planet which would have gone through chemo 24 hours ago, blood transfusions. You know, he's there tonight, you know, he's there in full spirit and he's giving it 110%. I didn't just go out of hospital this morning. I'm sure a lot of you guys are aware of my condition. Uh, I've got cancer. He's ill. You still sort of think to yourself, geez, why couldn't they just open me up, just cut them out, and just throw them away? We're gonna play a bit of rapid tag. So seeing as we're not in a, in a circle right here, this is just like a YouTube cipher. You have to call out the person you want to go next. Hunter, SPX, I'm tagging you in, son, you're number eight. My name's Hunter, told you that before. I'm here, I'm in the middle of a personal war against cancer. Hit my pancreas and my liver, but I'm a survivor. That's Hunts, you know, just letting it all out, not um, self-editing too much. going to bloody work. What else am I sick of? Sick of living all the way out here in Thornley and I'm sick of being single. I'm sick of not seeing Marley Bear every day and coming home to Marley Bear and my family. And that's my fault. I fucked that up. Because I guess, I guess I did, thought I didn't want it. I guess I thought I didn't want it. And now it's all I want. What the fuck? I hope no one's going to fucking watch this ever. I meet this guy, Dr. Raj. And he gave me the printout. So the radiologists feel that uh, things have... Uh, Pretty stable. No, they've probably increased the number and size. How do you know? The anterior at the junction of segment 4A. So I, I'm not scared. I'm not going to... I'm going to be... I'm going to shrink it. I'm going to have to call it. I'm upset about it for now. Tomorrow and today, and we'll start shrinking it. <laughs> this is the, the cancer juice. Yeah, so that's breakfast. I, and I, I, I'm very proud of that breakfast day. I, I, I take photos of it on my phone and just go, yes, good on you, Hunter. That's a good, that's a good look at breakfast. Before I had cancer, I was a drunk and uh, into drugs. And I was wasting my life. I'm not pissed off that I've got these tumours. It's changed my life and I've learnt to, to value relationships with people. It's opened my eyes to the real world. I, I betrayed her, you know. I thought I could live a life, a party life and a home life as well. And I thought that I could keep them separate and that, and that it wouldn't matter. But it did, you know. I've got a lot, of, a lot of projects on at the moment too, so... While I'm, while I'm feeling good, I'm going to get busy.
business, a man who tried to do things right So my son could look up to the stars at night With pride and say my old man died for the right things I look at him, he smiles and my heart sings You made it, it was success, you're on the Triple J Hip Hop Show tonight <laughs> You stopped drinking, you stopped going out and, and you were really creative and constructive. I was scared that I was going to die without um, without releasing some of the songs. I was like, geez, I've got to start recording some of these rap songs I've been writing. Yeah. I'm not scared of death, I'm scared that at my last breath I'll regret leave something unsaid or something in my head like an unpaid debt or an unmade bed. Something that I need to finish just to show you that I cared the way I lived my life. Got me thinking maybe I wasted my life getting wasted from drinking but there's no use sinking into a pit of depression and wondering what the fuck I'll learn my fucking lesson maybe learn too late. There's no use for hate in this life or my place. Just remember to face up to your fears. I